Today's morning commute took a turn for the worst in the hilltop parking lot. At about 10.45 a.m., a white Jeep flipped on its side after a reported two-car accident in this York Hill commuter lot. I was getting ready in my room for my class, and we heard a loud crash. Um, it sounded like a garbage pail being knocked over by the wind. We opened up the blinds. We saw the car overturned on its side in the parking lot. And there was another car in the road just sitting there. The front bumper looked a little messed up, but it looked fine. In seconds, bystanding students jumped into action by calling 911 and public safety. Well, I ran over and other people were running over to see like what was going on. And there was like the airbags had gone off and the mirrors were smashed. The girl was screaming. Um, I felt really bad. She was alone. Um, she didn't have any friends in the car with her, which was good that no one else was hurt. But she definitely looked like, terrified. Hamden Police Department, Fire Department, and Public Safety were able to safely rescue the student from the flipped vehicle where she was trapped in the driver's seat for several minutes. The student reportedly has minor injuries and was taken to Yale New Haven Hospital. I, I mean, I park there every day. I drive my car down from York. I live on York Hill. And every day I go down there, there's usually people just like flying or people fighting for spots. I think that's why the accident happened, is just because there's so many cars and there's people trying to get to class and find parking, and everyone's just in a rush. And I think that rush causes people to be a little careless when they drive. I also think like the university should try and like take some better action, just because I know they've tried to change parking before to try and like prevent any types of situations between like cars or between students, but I just think that like given this, clearly there's something that needs to be done. In Hilltop parking lot, Christina Vitas, Q30 News.